Hi guys, yeah, a couple of days since uh, Buddy Yak is. <laughs> it's smaller to go down and uh, pick up my daughter and take her shopping. And from her front gate, you looking across, we could see a copper with a camera taking pictures of this house. So anyway, right, it was intriguing. So we decided instead of going that way, we go that way and drive down past the house. And it's one of those times where I need to kick my own ass. Every time something cool comes up, I've left the camera alone. Same deal today. But what they were taking pictures of was this. Now that was on every wall of this house, all the way around. Uh, by the time I'd taken her shopping and done this and that, and I raced home and got the camera, uh, there was three or four people and they'd spray painted the spray painted all out, so it was no good. So I guess around here, you know, for a t small town like I live in, if you don't pay your drug bills, apparently you're going to get nasty words and symbols written on your house. Now apparently, I also found out that they did this once before to the same place, to the same person, but only they did it inside the house when she wasn't home. Uh, no, I don't feel sorry for her. If you want to get into that position where you're on, in, on drugs and you tick it up and you don't pay your, your drug money, well, fair enough. You know, I thought it was a classic. It's the first time I've ever seen it in this bloody town. I know it's pretty rife, but uh, I've never ever seen that on somebody's front fence. Oh, I mean, sorry, whole house. Uh, coppers took pictures of it, but I don't think they'll ever find out who it is. Uh, they're too close, too close mouth. Because uh, I reckon if she did, if she did tell them who it was. She'd have more than that done to her house. She'd probably be burnt alive in it. Okay, that's all I've got. <laughs> Catch us later. Bye.